Hi everyone, I'm very excited to release our new interactive game, Go Go Bananas, illustrated and created by Go Go Speech. This is an adorable game to kick off our zoo animal theme, and your kids are going to love all of the silly monkey fun as they work toward all of their goals. You'll see lots of different monkeys throughout that will give you a ton of opportunities for speech and language tasks, but you're gonna have to feed them all really quick before the big gorilla wakes up from his nap and steals all the bananas from us. Just like the rest of our activities, you should be able to adjust the way that you play this based on the goals that you're working on. You can use it as a motivation activity during your session or to get some really good language from your kids requesting describing singing making structured sentences and you'll get some really great spontaneous language out of this as well you can also adjust your presentation of the activity to work on core words and very simple language tasks throughout the game for this game we're going to start off with our magic doors and you can see if your kids can guess what the activity might be about based on the objects on the door so i'm going to go ahead and walk you through it with lots of tips and tricks for how you can use it with your kids open. We're in the jungle. That's a lot of bananas. And tell your kids that it's time to feed the monkeys, but we have to feed them all quick before the gorilla wakes up from his nap because he doesn't like to share his pile of bananas. So you could also say that you're at the zoo and you have to be a zookeeper today and help feed the monkeys in the monkey area. So first we'll need to fill up this crate with lots of bananas. And while we're over here, we can work on the SH sound. Shh, the gorilla is sleeping. Grab the bananas, put them in the crate or in the box or the basket. Let's go to the trees to find those monkeys. Hmm, I don't see them. Maybe we need to do something to get them to come out. And you can also tell your kids that they have to let you know if they see any monkeys come out of those trees. I definitely recommend that if you're working on a speech sound, you can pre-plan a structured sentence or phrase that you can use to prompt your child to say each time he or she wants a monkey to come out. So if they're working on the K sound, prompt them to say, come out monkey. Or the S sound, you could say, we want to see you. Or SH, you could say, shh show us what you look like, and so on. Whoa, a cheerleader monkey? So silly. So you can use this game as a motivational activity between reps. You might tell them that in order for the monkeys to come out, they have to say a word, a sentence, or complete a language task a certain number of times, and then a new monkey will pop out. You can also use it as a motivational activity to work on attention and engagement with your kids. Each of the monkeys have a silly outfit, so you'll be able to talk about each of them as they come out. You might tell the child that we need to describe the monkey in order for it to open its mouth so we can feed it. This is great for any kids working on describing or formulating sentences. The monkey is wearing a skirt. You can shake the pom-poms. The monkey opened its mouth. Grab a banana and pretend to grab one from the crate or the basket. Feed the monkey. Or you can say, throw it in its mouth. Push it. Give it to the monkey. And the monkey will go away to eat its banana. Hmm. Come out, monkey. Whoa, a base ball monkey wearing a glove red hat you can also pretend each monkey gives you a list of words to say each time he pops up thank you hmm what does it say show shake feed the monkey now another way you can use this activity is to incorporate songs so I just made up this simple song that you can use to try to get the monkeys to come out and it goes to the tune of are you sleeping Monkey, 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 where are you? Where are you? I have some bananas, I have some bananas, you can too, you can too. And then the next monkey will pop up. An artist monkey, a painter, lots of colors, paintbrush, here's a banana. And you can use any of the ideas that I mentioned to invite the next monkey into the game, making sure to choose a method that works best for your child to get lots of trials in. Monkey, 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 where are you? Where are you? I have some bananas, I have some bananas. You can too, you can too. <gasps> a swimming monkey, a snorkel, flippers, a swim tube or float, goggles, feed the monkey. 
And there are three more monkeys. So there's seven monkeys total. <gasps> a drummer monkey, drumsticks. Feed the monkey. A monkey with long blue hair, sunglasses, bracelet, and you'll feed the monkey. Have the child say or do something to get the next monkey to come out. A farmer monkey, straw hat, overalls, corn. Feed the monkey. Now this time something different is gonna happen when we ask a monkey to come out. Come out, monkey. Whoa! Four monkeys came out of the trees. All the monkeys. Maybe they want more bananas. Good thing there's still more in the crate. What's happening? He's banging on the drum. And you can go back and forth between these two slides to make the monkey bang on his drum. Uh-oh. If the monkey makes too much noise, what might happen? Remember that gorilla? They look surprised. You see a head. Oh no, the gorilla woke up from her nap. She's so big. What is she going to do? She's eating all the bananas. Oh no, the crate is empty. So now you can say, I think the gorilla went back to sleep. Let's go grab some more bananas from the pile so we can feed the monkeys again. And you can continue playing the game. You can also jump around the slides when you're playing the game. So you can have that gorilla pop out at any point when you play. So you don't have to wait until all seven monkeys get the bananas. And you can surprise your kids when they're least expecting it. Having that gorilla pop out into the screen and stealing all of the bananas in the crate. Oh no. So I hope you all have so much fun with this one. Make sure you're following GoGo -Go Speech on Instagram and Facebook and subscribe to our YouTube channel to stay up to date on our latest releases. I'll see you all next time. Bye.